Hi, my name is Eric. I am the Fender Rep for Texas, and I'm here at Lancaster Music for the Tip of the Day. Some of these Tip of the Days I've been seeing are showing some cool guitar licks and exercises and stuff. I want to go back to the beginning, and I recently was showing a friend of mine, uh, an adult, taking lessons, and guitar is all about muscle memory. And we were showing basic chords, and here's a basic G chord. And then I showed him the C chord, and then a D chord. The problem he's having, and most beginners have, is switching from here to here to here. And what happens is we're doing this, one, two, three, four, and then, uh, your muscle memory, okay, two, two, three, four, and then, uh, your muscle memory, and here. The problem with that, you're not developing rhythm. So a technique I've come up with is, Count four. One, two, three, 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 four. Then back to the G. As you develop this, you're going to build your speed to where you can go one, two, one, two, one, two. One, two, the next, one, and one, 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 and soon you build up your speed. The reason why this, I think, is important, because you build timing at the same time, as opposed to struggling to get it to the next chord. So, when you start playing music, it flows a little more. I'm going to give you a bonus tip of the day has to do with the right hand, which gets neglected quite a bit. Because you're focusing so much here, this one might be straight. I recommend putting a heavy rubber band around here or something. Just deaden the strings. Put a piece of cloth in the sound hole or under there so you get the sound. Or, of course, just use your hands. Listen to the song you're trying to learn. And don't worry about chords. Listen to the rhythm. And if the rhythm is... Might be that, might be just a, uh, a three four. This way, you're going to focus on muscle memory of rhythm in your hand. So, if I'm doing it with chords, eventually. And so, I recommend take your favorite song, get the right hand, mute the strings, and just play with the rhythm. Then everything else will become second nature. That's all I got.